Now, Way 31 Storm Tracker Meteorologist Grace Anello with 31 Triple Doppler. Grace, I don't know if right now if we are operating on regular power, <laughs> generator power, but uh, just a little bit ago, we had uh, a few light tricks going on in here because of that wind and yes. storm. Yeah, absolutely. So we have a 600-foot tower off to the side of the studio, yeah. and sometimes when it gets windy, that affects us, and it could be affecting you this morning as well. You might not have a 600-foot mm. tower, but it could blow your car yeah. on the way to work. Let's take a look at 31 Triple Doppler because it's an active scene already. 515 on your Tuesday morning, and the heaviest concentration of rain we're watching is along and east of the I-65 corridor. So farther to the west, you're starting to see some lighter precipitation, but you will see more rain throughout the course of the rest of the morning and into the afternoon. So even if it's not raining on you right now in Lawrenceburg or in Muscle Shoals, still bring your umbrella with you because you're going to need it a little bit later on this morning. Our 31 alert day still in effect, but a reminder that's not because of any type of storms. It's because of our gusty winds, the one that's that we're blowing our tower here at the studio that in effect through six o'clock this morning and it could definitely blow your car when you're out on the roads. Take a look at 31 at the way 31 Skycam network powered by Thompson roofing and construction. If you look closely, you can see how slick the roads are and I can tell you from personal experience hydroplaning is a possible issue this morning. I had to drive very slowly and very carefully because the roads are very ponded. Our temperatures at this time sitting in the upper 40s and low 50s. Now when Taylor talked to you last night, Night, he mentioned we're going to have a brief lull in the wind speeds when we get to the later morning and then they'll ramp back up in the afternoon and that still holds true. Our wind gusts at the moment sitting in the 30 and 40 mile an hour range expected to dip down and then increase as we head later through the day. For that reason, our wind advisory doesn't expire until the stroke of midnight tonight into first thing tomorrow morning. So prep for very, very windy conditions throughout the day today because that's not going anywhere. All right, now here's the kicker, something you might not expect. Our high temperature, we're reaching it as we speak. All of this rain and wind is coming to us from a cold front. And once that cold front moves through, it's bringing a blast of Arctic air that will actually cool our temperatures as we head through the rest of the day. So lower 50s for our temperatures right now. By the time we get to noon at 50 and then dinner time, we're sitting in the mid 40s. So a lot to talk about in just one day. The rain staying strong with us through the rest of the morning. It will return by the time we get to about 630. So remember in the shoals, we talked about how you could be dry right now, but more rain is coming. This is that rain. So again, bring your umbrella with you regardless of where you live when you walk out the door. By about lunchtime, we'll start to see some clearing and plenty of cloud cover still on tap, but I would still plan to have your rain jacket with you. You might not need your rain boots or your umbrella at that point, but a light jacket would be good in case you're one of the ones that does have one of those pop-up showers remaining in your system. We'll be dry right Right around that three o'clock coffee break with plenty of cloud cover, but then shortly thereafter we enter into the mix more rain and a possible wintry mix. Now don't go getting too excited. Our temperatures are much too warm for any of this to stick. However, models continue to trend that we will see a mix of rain, possible freezing rain and some flurries tonight as well. So just expect that to be in your forecast. You don't need to cancel your plans tomorrow. You don't need to worry about the roads icing over. You're going to be okay. Okay, I promise. I just don't want you to be concerned when you see some flurries or some freezing rain falling from the sky. A reminder that 31 Alert Day is in effect through 6 o'clock this morning. When you wake up tomorrow morning, just 31 degrees. Our high temperature sitting in the upper 40s, but finally some sunshine. Let's head out in the field in the Way 31 Storm Tracker to meteorologist Amber Kulik so she can tell us what she's seeing on the roads and how we can best stay safe on the